Oh, are you for real? Are you for Rizzity real? Okay, great. <laughs> Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play The Long Dark. My name is Weasel, and thank you so much for letting me know when and where you watch the show. I was wondering if there is maybe something else you could tell me. Uh, I'm curious in what kind of things you would like to see in The Long Dark, and if there is a challenge you could come up with. Uh, the idea is basically that I've been playing this game <laughs> for 92 hours, which is not as much as it could be. You know, it could be the Golden 3... The Golden 3... Numbers, 100 hours and more. Uh, I'll be getting there soon. But my question is, is there something you would like to see? We started off this series pretty strong uh, by <laughs> starting it off completely naked in the stalker difficulty and then, you know, made our way forward. Now, is there a, something you would like me to do? I don't know, like run across a map naked and see if that's possible. Fight a wolf without clothes. Why is every of my challenges involve me not wearing anything? First of all, I want to repair. Oh, I need cured guts. Oh no. I forgot about the cured guts to repair. The wolf skin coat. Well, guess what? We're gonna hunt ourselves a wolf. Um, we're not done here. Yep, we're not. I, I thought we were. I mean, I could always carry all of that stuff, but that's not worth it. Anyways, uh, we should wear all the clothes if we get out. But yeah, we have to get some cured guts, and I doubt uh, we're going to wear all of that. I doubt we're just going to be able to find that anywhere. Uh, I don't need to work boots. Yeah, the more I wear, the better. I don't want to freeze out there. Put those socks on, and we are fully equipped. Rifle, right, 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 right. A hunting rifle. <laughs> 78%. I could clean it. I'm encumbered, though. Probably because I'm carrying so much meat hmm, and so much water. How about we drop, like, all of it? I mean, may maybe keep a liter just in case we, you know, get stuck outside. But, yeah, drop drop a lot of that meat. One meat will do fine. We're, we're a little bit encumbered. 30.15. But, yeah, we need cured guts. The question is, do we go back to camp office where we have a whole lot of other stuff? And the cured guards, or do I farm some wolves? Nope, they're all gone already. I'm not surprised to see that after so many days. So, hmm, going back to camp office would be one way to deal with the situation. I mean, I have the cured wolf pelts, okay? Let's let's carry that stuff. We want that. We don't want to leave any of that behind. Here, a lot of food. I want to bring the salty crackers. They're great. Other than that, I might just leave everything behind. I mean, this is a big pile of food. All right, leave it for the next guy who comes by. Um, the work boots, we can definitely harvest them, and I want to do that. Where are they? Where are my work boots? Um, and my idea is... Uh, repair. Uh, nope, harvest. My idea is to basically just bring the most important things with me. Go back to camp office. Uh, where we should find some cured guts. Okay, I'm gonna bring the bear hide. Screw that. I'm not gonna give up on that. Um, and yeah, make our ways back. Ooh, cup of herbal tea. I'll bring that along, I guess. Uh, drop that. And yep, a lot of meat. God, so much meat. And water. <sighs> I figure leaving some water behind is not the worst idea, considering that we're gonna need it sooner or later. Um, a whetstone and flares, yeah. Definitely gonna bring all the flares. Flares are important to deal with wolves and the whetstone to sharpen the blades. Okay, here's a plan. I'm gonna stay in. I'm gonna eat and drink a st uh, some of the stuff and I'm gonna sharpen all my knives and blades before we head out. Um, that should do the trick. And oh, look at that bedroll. That thing needs to be repaired. Let's do that. Let's Let's repair all of our stuff. One hour of daylight left. Wonderful. We're probably going to work for the night, sleep a few hours. I don't know how long. Repair. Seems like... Yeah, I need more cloth. Hmm. Well, guess who made its way back once I offered some sunflower seeds. Don't I have some cloth over here that I harvested from the bedroll? Possibly. Then again, I might have already used that. Nope, it's still here. Cloth. Cured wolf pelts. Um, empty backpack. I thought I had more cloth. Apparently, I already used it. I can't remember. Oh, wait a second. <laughs> of course, I had the other bedroll up here, which is in better condition. This is 90% condition. We can harvest the cloth. We'll get 10 cloth from ripping apart that bedroll. That's good. And then we can repair the other one. We don't need two. So let's go ahead and repair that thingy. 
And it's time to sharpen our hatchet. Look at that, 47%. We really, it really took us a, took a beating there. Oh, some of you might be wondering where my hat went. I actually have no idea where my Domokun hat is, so we're wearing the weasel hat plus a cap because I do that from time to time. Don't worry, it'll be back once I find it. Wonderful, our hatchet is at 99%. Very happy about that. That took, that took quite a while. But uh, yeah, we're just gonna sharpen one hunting knife. I think I'm gonna leave one behind. And I ruined a whetstone. <laughs> Doesn't matter, we have more. There's more. I'm gonna probably bring both along. Wonderful, and we have 100% hunting knife. That is all I want. The pry bar, on the other hand, we can't repair that. The only thing we get from that is uh, scrap metal when we break it. Um, other than that, I think it's time to repair our clothes and then get some more sleep. Basic wool scarf. All right, perfect. We've rested for seven hours. Uh, a little bit dehydrated. That's why I took a hit. I for just simply forgot to drink something. <sighs> All right, here's the plan. I'm going to bring most of that food with me. Um, I'm going to eat those crackers. Why not? Just give me a few calories. That condition isn't very good anymore. Uh, eat that bear meat just to get rid of the remainder. Uh, 900 calories. Yeah, that's all bear meat. I don't have any meat left, right? No. All right, we're gonna bring that. The bedroll. We're gonna pick it up. Hunting knife. We're gonna leave it behind. Water bottles. We're gonna leave them behind. And pretty much try to go with <sighs> at least stuff that I need. Um, there's so much stuff I would just I just want. Okay, refuel that lantern. I guess I could leave some of that fuel behind. The jerry can itself doesn't weigh too much. 0.3 kilograms, we can keep that. Matches, quite a few. I guess it makes sense to drop a few packets of it, at least. I really want to keep the arrowheads because I'm fairly certain we're going to need that in the future. Okay, judging from my inventory, I'm still quite encumbered. 41 kilograms of, or 41 over 30. Ah, that's okay though. We're gonna leave. I don't want to leave any other stuff behind. I left behind a lot of food and burning materials, stuff that I don't really need. But I'm just gonna take the food, the uh, the spoiled or are going to be spoiled soon food with me, and we're gonna head out to new adventures, or actually not as new adventures because I'm trying to head back to camp office. Where I'm gonna find some cured guts. I mean, I do have in the worst case. Where is it? I have a few bullets. I should reload. Just figuring that out. I have five bullets in my rifle. Well, five rifle rounds. I am not entirely sure what the difference between a round and a bullet is. Maybe it's just a synon it's synonymous. Who knows? In any case... Uh, oh, trunk. Wait, didn't I search it before? No! Hmm. I'll take that extra cloth. Uh, we're gonna lose weight as we go along. As we go along our path back to camp office, we will lose weight. Just by, purely by eating and drinking, not, you know, we will lose weight. Maybe a little bit too, a few calories here and there will be lost. But still, we're gonna be just fine. And of course, I can't run because I'm completely encumbered. Good times. I see I can eat something, that's good. Gotta bring that below 40. If it's below 40, I might be able to eat a, uh, to run again. In case I need to. Not that I necessarily want to, just in case I need to. The problem is it's gonna really... I, I'm gonna feel really slight. Wait, why am I so cold? I'm wearing all of these things. Oh, that's not good. Okay, not good. Not happy about that. At least I have a rough idea where I need to head back to. Just down the highway and through the cave should bring us back to Coastal Highway, where we could make a stop at the gas station again, and then find our way back over the ravine ah, to camp office. Yeah, this is gonna be a long, long march. Just to repair some clothes. Seems silly, doesn't it? I mean, worst case, if we don't make it there, I can always shoot a wolf, gut the poor animal, and use the guts then, after they're cured, to repair my pants. Oh, are you for real? Are you for Rizzy real? What? He didn't even give me a chance. You, you son of a schnitzel! What in the name of everything that's? <gasps> Look at that! My deer skin pants are at five percent and six percent wolf skin coat. Wow. Okay. 
That's not cool. Um, I have no afflictions, but yeah, I'm really cold now. Great. He nearly, he nearly ruined that part. And now I'm using a flare. Okay. This is going to make my trip back way harder because I'm basically wearing shit clothing at this point. What is that? Oh, you killed a rabbit? Yeah, I bet you're proud. Bet you're proud if you ravaged. I can get some guts, though. 20 minutes, though. Mmm. I'm gonna be too cold. I'm gonna be frozen before I reach anything, so... Best course of action would be... How far am I away am I? Best course of action... Mmm... You know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna pick up some sticks. Start a fire in the burnt out church, warm up, and then keep moving through the abandoned mine. This is gonna be a tricky path towards our cured guts. You know, at this point, it still warms me a little bit, but not too much. At this point, I wish I had exchange clothes somewhere. If we can't find them, I'm gonna break down. Um, if I can find some, I'll switch them out. Oh, I'm freezing. Great, okay. Good times. So we have like four sticks that should allow us to warm up. Oh man, that silly wolf. Surprise, he really just came for me. I had no, not a single moment to turn on a flare or anything. I was not reacting fast enough. And he really did a number to my deer skin pants and my jacket. I am going to have to harvest some deer hide as well. Okay, I'm so slow I can't even walk fast anymore. But a few more sticks are a good idea to warm up properly. Because that's what I need. Feels like minus 10. Ah! Taking condition hits now. Into the safety of the church. Very good. In case we need some, we have some planks. Alright, let's start a fire. Got some tinder blocks. Yeah, 89%. I'm gonna use an accelerant because I really need to warm up fast. And we're gonna add all the sticks. Oh, the heat output isn't very high. 53 minutes though. I can break down these planks, add some fuel. Yeah, it's, it's still not warm enough. Still feels really cold, so we're gonna have to add the reclaimed wood. Okay, I think we're warming up. Very good. Ah, bedroll. I'm just gonna rest for an hour. That should bring up my condition a little bit. I should warm up, and I still have seven hours of daylight left. We're gonna spend most of that probably outside, and then a big chunk of it in the mines. Yep, I'm warm again. That's good. Let's see. I think I already looked for that first aid kit, yeah. Let's see, you don't have any clothes with you, do you? Nope, you don't. You do not. What I can do is I can repair whatever I have left um, with cloth. For example, the toque. It's not going to make a big difference, but it's going to give me that 1 or 2, uh, 0 0.2 degrees warmth bonus. And I need everything at this point, thanks to a wolf that ravaged my pants and <sighs> everything else. The socks... Okay, the mittens, 50%, that's definitely worth repairing. Because we basically get like half the mittens back. And I hope they won't be ruined. If they will, we are screwed. At this point, I might actually take them off and I might be better off not wearing them. 0.1 degrees warmth bonus, not too much. Here, on the other hand, I'll, I'll wear it. But these things basically broken. Okay, let's repair the scarf. And then we're gonna head out. Oh yeah, and I'm thirsty, so it's probably a good idea to drink and eat something. I mean, I smell like bear meat. Shouldn't that deter some? I mean, then again, I probably smell really good. It's cooked meat. No, no surprise they attack me. Now that I think about it. Ugh. All right. We're heading out. We're he heading home. I'm going home. So done with this region. So done with these wolves and everything. Okay, minus five. That's manageable. We're still gonna freeze over time. And I can run. It doesn't make a tremendous difference, so I might as well walk so we don't run out of energy too fast. But at least we can if we wanted to. <sighs> you know, the only thing that I would need right now would be that everything's fogging up and there's a blizzard. That's that's like the only thing I would need. And of course, a wolf chasing after me, keeping me on my toes. I am always worried about wolves now. Okay, so as far as I remember, I have to go up here and then to the left. 
Hopefully. There's not mine, mine entrance. Okay, I see a bunny over there. New interest. You know what? Curing the gut will take too long. I was thinking of maybe getting actually the... Wait, can I go here? Hmm. There's a mine, which is great. It's just not the mine that I need. I just wonder if I can... Nope, I can't. I was I was hoping I could walk this way, but nope. There must be a way up there to the other mine entrance. This is another mine. I actually don't even know where it leads. It might just lead to the opposite side of that hill in Desolation Point. Because I know that the other one will lead to the Crumbling Highway and the Coastal Highway. So, I'll stick with what I know. No, it's not time for exploring right now. It is time to make our way home to camp office. Or at least to that base. Oh, look at that. A remnant of earlier times. A burned out flare. Good times. Back when I still had my deerskin pants and wolf skin coat. Back then. But yes, looking good. We're making our way back. Having a sense of direction is paramount in this game. They just keep running around me. Man. Okay, are, are you alright? He, he seems very lost. Thing is, I would have to use a bullet on him. Which I don't want to do. If I could just knife him as he runs by, just... You know. Then I would probably do that for some fresh meat or so. But, yeah. He's, he's not worth the bullet. If you can down a deer with a bullet around, then you should do that instead. For some weird reason, it seems that the snow is picking up. The temperature, eh, minus four. Not completely burned out yet. So many rabbits. I'll get my rabbit skin mittens eventually. But for now, we have more important issues to deal with. Rose hips. Yeah, no, no interest. Thank you very much. Cool. Leaf desolation point. Yeah, this is our mine that will bring us back, hopefully, to Crumbling Highway. Old Island Connector, number three mine. Right, we left the hatchet behind. I don't need that right now. New sprint roll and the empty drawers. Cool. Let's have a quick inventory check. I could drink and eat something to, you know, ease up on the inventory space. Oh, wait, at least. We're 38 out of 30. That's okay. Okay, light. You know what? I will use. I will use the lantern. I think I deserve using. having light. Oh! Hmm. Going. I don't even know where to go. Let's keep going straight. And hope that this will bring us back to Crumbling Highway. I do not remember what is the proper way. The other one might have. The other way might have ended in a dead end. This might be the right one. Ah, this is, this is incredibly creepy here. Any moment I wonder if stuff is gonna break down. Or how they're gonna incorporate that into the story mode. Maybe at one point we're gonna see predators. Bats would be. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Really? Okay, for a second I thought I was stuck there. Bats would be a really nice addition to this, or some sort of underground animal. Oh, yeah, right. The dead guy over here with the pry bar. What's the condition of the pry bar? 39%. The pry bar that I am currently having has 33. Might as well drop this one and grab this one. Those 6%. Big difference, not really. Okay, a lot of coal. I don't intend to smelt anything. Right, I remember you. Storm Lantern. No use for that right now. Just making sure that I'm not leaving any clothing behind. I've never seen some here. But I'm sure we're going to be able to find alternative clothing as soon as we come back to Coastal Highway. There's the three houses at the end. And I'm pretty sure I haven't like completely searched for them. So let's hope for the best. Okay, so... Let's just, happy thoughts, wait. Where am I? Wait, that's a dead end. Wait, um, come again? Is it here? Yes. Okay. <gasps> we found the exit, let's just hope that it's, it is the other exit and not the entry that we came in. That is entirely possible. I mean, you gotta be really desperate to crawl down the shaft here. I mean, this, this looks, like, it just crumbled down and any little touch will break it. Oh, no, this is... Yeah, this is the different exit. Very good. I think we made it back. Let's see where we are. Gonna make sure to turn off that lantern. We are on... 
Old Island Connector, Crumbling Highway. Yay! We made it back, guys. At, le at least <laughs> so far. The journey isn't over yet. Camp office, here we come. Uh, how do I feel? I'm a little bit tired, which means I won't be able to run uh, anymore. I shouldn't run at least. How much? Five hours of daylight left. That works out well. So I think we're going to be able to just make it over the crumbling highway. I think there were no huts here. And if so, yeah, back there, there's one that's burned down. So we're not going to find that particular piece of clothing I've been longing and hoping for. The latest fashion trend in survival gear. The warm coat. But yeah. Silly wolf. It just attacked me. Didn't give me a chance. Just gotta make sure that I don't encounter another one. What am I seeing there? I see a ravaged deer. Um, I do need that deer skin hide. Remember for my deer skin pants? Because they're pretty ruined as well, so the best way to do this would probably to make a little fire next to it so we don't freeze. And hope for the best. Did I leave some firewood behind? That would be the best. Or is that just the burned out campfire? Nope, it's fur firewood. Fantastic. Yeah, we're gonna start a little fire here with our fur firewood. So we don't freeze to death. You know what, I'm gonna bring these feathers. I'm not entirely sure, but I might need them for arrows. Uh-oh, great. Great, it's a storm. Oh, are you for real? Are you for Rizzity real? Okay, great. Ah, um, uh, that's bad. That is bad. I can light a torch with a match. There. And then brandish that thing. Go! Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! No! What happens if I throw it at him? Oh, shit! Good job, Weasel! Good, good, good job! I'm trying to fight back and not die. It's gonna get close. Oh, he's dead. Okay, good. First aid. Ha! Huh. Treat wounds. Uh, let's hope that I didn't lose any of my pants and they're not completely ruined. All right, we treated our wounds. Ah, oh, man. Uh, Wolf's coat is still intact. You know what, I'm gonna wear those freaking pants. For all I care. Cool. That went great, Weasel. That went fantastic. It's a snowstorm. I have 6%. I'm chilled. It's time for a fire in here. As much as I would love to use one. Freaking use the torch up. Why did I extinguish it? I thought I could throw it, but you can't throw torches. <sighs> anyway. Bed roll and start a fire. Right over here. Oh, we're gonna have to spend the night, guys. We're gonna have to spend the night. That's silly. <sighs> okay. Cool, we got a fire going. I'm gonna add some more fuel for firewood. Okay, two and a half hours. I'm too cold to do anything. My only hope, my only, only hope is to actually put down to sleep and hope that the cup of herbal tea, you know what, I can heat it up actually. I should heat it up. Uh, that the cup of herbal tea is gonna bring me some condition back. I will probably need all two hours of sleep and then hope to make it back somehow. Oh, this is a uh, drink. Nice hot cup of herbal tea. It's gonna save me, all right? Okay, hours to rest. Wait, I still have some t time. Okay, two hours. Let's hope we don't freeze to death. We shouldn't next to that fire, we should be fine. Ah, nail biting. Okay, we're back at 21%. That's not too bad. Drink some water. Still cold. I'm not. I didn't really warm up that much. Anything I can repair while I'm at it. Didn't take too much hit. I think the wool socks, maybe. Maybe the work boots. I can repair them with the cured leather I have. One hour and tw two minutes. Might be worth it. Oh, never mind. Cancel. I'm freezing right next to the frigging campfire. Are you for real? Feels like minus eight. It's dark. It's late. Um, pick up. Okay, I have one chance at this. I have one go, guys. I have one go, guys. We have to go back to the mine. I don't think I don't think going anywhere else is a good idea at this point. 
Okay, run, weasel, run. This is your only... Wait. Oh, sh did I bring my bedroll? Yes, I brought my bedroll. Okay, just making sure. I don't think the cave is warm enough. The cave doesn't hold uh, the warmth as well as apparently a mine does. For, you know, God knows what reason. But yeah, that's what happens when you get too greedy and want that deer, deer hide. Um... I gotta go around that rock. Man! I'm, I'm not looking too hot right now. I am not looking too hot. Uh, at least I'm a killer the wolf. So that, that, that should bring my wolf kill counter up for what it's worth. Oh yeah, not, not a good day. Not a good day. In my books. Okay, I'm too tired to run. Do I still have improved rest? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Let's hope it is warm enough in the cave. And we're not running into too many more problems. Feels like minus 40 degrees Celsius. Whoa, that's pretty much the same temperature you would have at like 30,000 feet. It is really cold. It is really cold. Okay, so in here feels like 9 degrees. For whatever magical reason, this is a really warm cave. Which means here we can sleep to our heart's content for 8 hours until the darkness is over. And we should be good. At least we should get some of our condition back. Look at that, 55%. I'm gonna have some water, I'm gonna have some food, I'm gonna sleep for... It's, I mean, the storm is still going on. I'm gonna sleep for a few hours and then we're gonna head back. I don't think I'm gonna grab any of that wolf meat, any of that deer skin. It's, it's too risky at this point. I just wanna head home. I'm gonna rest for another six hours and hope this saves me. Is the storm still going on? It sounds like it. I'm not happy about that. Yep, feels like minus 11. It's still a tad too windy for me, honestly. Tad too windy. Ooh. So, what I'll do instead... How many hours? 11 hours. Yeah, we can sleep for 3 hours and then continue in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Don't forget... If you have something you would like to see, if you have a challenge or an idea what we could, something crazy we could try, leave it in the comments below. Anyways, I'm Weasel, I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye bye!